Crooked Joe came in and turned our country into an absolute dumping ground. In New York this month, an illegal alien criminal pled guilty to savagely murdering a man in broad daylight. You read about it. Stabbing him ten times in the stomach after also allegedly stabbing and gravely wounding a man in Maryland. He did. He won a crime spree. Wonderful to have him in our country, right? Wonderful. He came in, no problem. In Florida this week, an illegal alien woman was arrested for trying to hire a contract assassin to kill two people. They killed two people violently, and she was the one that hired them. And in February, an illegal alien set loose into our country by crooked Joe Biden was arrested for leading a major New Jersey gang that smuggled illegal aliens across the border, killing many, killing many. Now, I only ask you this question because some of you have heard it, most of you have heard it, but I have it here if you want. Would anybody like to hear, because this is the border, would anybody like to hear this snake? It's a Saturday evening. We got nothing but time. What the hell? I love these Saturday evenings. Is there anything better than a Trump rally? If some of these wackos came along, you know, these liberals saying, said, actually, vote for me. You know, they all vote for me. They say, oh, Trump, I don't know. You know, like Bruce Springsteen. We have a much bigger crowd than Bruce Springsteen, right? Much bigger. I'm sure he's a nice guy. How about Chris Christie? You say, I love Bruce Springsteen. And then they used to throw him out of the concert. When somebody throws you out of a concert, you shouldn't love them. You sort of say, I don't like that music, right? I remember him saying that. Then they threw him out of the concert. So this is uh, having to do with our border, an old great song. I had to change it a little bit to make it pertinent, but it is very pertinent and very true. And it's called The Snake, and it talks about illegal Im immigration and how stupid it is what we're doing right now. We're letting people come into our country that will only be trouble. On her way to work one morning down the path, Along the lake, a tender-hearted woman saw a poor, half-frozen snake. His pretty colored skin had been all frosted with the dew. Poor thing, she sighed. I'll take you in, and I'll take care of you. That's our country. Take me in, O oh, tender woman. Take me in, for heaven's sake. Take me in, O oh, tender woman, sighed the vicious snake. She wrapped him up all cozy in a comforter of silk and laid him by her fireside with some honey and some milk. She hurried home from work that night, and soon as she arrived, she found the pretty snake she'd taken in had been revived. Take me in, O oh tender woman, take me in for heaven's sake. Take me in, O oh tender woman, sighed the vicious snake. She clutched him to her bosom, you're so beautiful, she cried. But if I hadn't brought you in by now, you truly would have died. She stroked his pretty skin again and kissed him and held him tight. But instead of saying, thank you, ma'am, the snake gave her a vicious bite. Take me in, O oh tender woman, take me in, for heaven's sake. Take me in, O oh tender woman, sighed the vicious snake. I saved you cried the woman, and you bit me, but why? You know your bite is poisonous, and now I'm going to die. Shut up, silly woman, said the reptile with a grin. You knew damn well I was a snake before you took me in. That's our country. That's our country, right? That's our country. Mr. Governor, right? That's what we're doing. I think it's very apropos. Did everybody enjoy that? Don't enjoy it. You should be, you should be scared by it. You shouldn't enjoy it. When I return to the White House, we will stop the plunder, rape, slaughter, and destruction of the American suburbs, cities, and towns. They're destroying your cities. They're destroying your towns and suburbs. We will shut down deadly sanctuary cities such as Newark and Philadelphia, we will not let criminals come into those cities. And we will not let them release illegal alien criminals into your streets. 
I will shift massive portions of federal law enforcement to immigration enforcement. And on day one, we will begin the largest domestic deportation operation in American history. No country can sustain what we're going through. It cannot be sustained, what we're going through. Millions and millions of people are taking over our cities, our suburbs. It cannot be sustained by any country.